Hello, monkeys! Mephesto, and yeah, this is Mephesto, and I bring you a battle, a UU battle with Xenon3120. And as you all know, and if you're watching my videos, you all know that UU is my worst tier, but yeah, let's get this started. He loses with his Goro, and I lead up with my Rider. Cause Ryder is a nigga and he can ride some chicks to his house and yeah, rape them. So, mm, yeah, I, I make a trick, he goes for a sucker punch that obviously fails, and now I switch into my uh, Mysel 9310, cause I know I can, this, um, this Goro can do nothing to me, and <coughs> something, something happens, I set up a sub, then I set up the leech seed trying to set up on this, um, uh, Nido King, but I fucking miss, and then he goes into Xerox, uh, Xerox, um, yeah, it's Xerox, it's a Madsen and Rush, I think, but yeah, whatever, so, um, he says it reflects, that reflect, that obviously sucks a big ass for me, so, now he switches into Xenon Fev, and he avoids my Leech Seed, and now Xenon is playing with me like little toy, seriously, so, my little, I, um, my, I let my Mysel 9310 to die, cause, no, not to die, cause I know the sleep powder is coming. I need a sleep powder to have a safe switch into my Easy Arthur, my Specs Alakazam. And he goes for a Swords Dance, and this this a little bit confused me. And I know, um, an um, I know probably he has the Umbreon, but, so, to go for Psychic is kinda useless. So I decided to go for Shadow Ball, that did like nothing. And now I go into my Vicious, my Drapion. Because Drapion is seriously cool as... Yeah, it's very cool, so... <coughs> he just fucking wins, so... Uh, he switches into Nidoking as I said of the Swords Dance, and now he sets up the... Re he has the Reflect, so... I know that basically... Um, that basically... Uh, Earthquake can't kill at this point, actually, but it's minimum damage, because, yeah, there were damage calculation and shit, so yeah. And he hits me with an earthquake, and I freaking live. So, yeah, I like Nidoking, it's a monster. But anyways, I live this freaking uh, earthquake, which was just amazing. So, yeah, but I have like one more turn left of uh, Life War, which was just awesome. And he goes into his Xerox, and he will die to the Night Slash, that's just 100% sure. And uh, I have one HP left after the Life Orb, so that was like, ha! He goes into S Ultra version 4. Then this is actually the thing that I really didn't want to see. I go for the cross poison, hoping for a poison, but I don't get it. And he goes to recover and recovers all the fucking H HP back. So that was kind of bad, bad for me. So I go into my Artem. Uh, go to myself. I don't know how you foreign people pronounce this. Pronounce because in Russia it's like Artyom and shit, and you pronounce like some Artem or something. He switches into Poly, no, into what's it called? Uh, fuck, into Venusaur, and he takes the um, Hypnosis. I switch into my uh, Alakazam. It's a double switch. He switches into Ultra Junior version one. He's bulky Raikou, and he takes the Focus Blast like a champ. Aspects Focus Blast hits me with a Discharge, but it did like nothing to me. Not actually nothing, but considering the paper defenses of um, my uh, Alakazam and shit, so. He goes into Venusaur, it's a double switch again, I think, I, d I don't know, and I go into my uh, Wet Monkey, I go for the Fake Out on the incoming Umbreon, that does quite, mm, I think, didn't do a whole lot considering that Umbreon is special deep bulky, not um, defense bulky, so, yeah, I go for the uh, ball hit, that does a lot, and he goes for a heal bell to wake his Venusaur, and um, at this point, Umbreon is kinda dead, cause and he won't be able to live another double hit, and yeah, so my wet monkey is looking nice here, cause yeah, wet monkeys are always beautiful and shit. So uh, he goes into Xenon Fev, and uh, actually, you see that um, the the miss with, with the focus blast mattered on the Venusaur. If you um, yeah, I I forgot to say about the miss on the Venusaur. I missed with focus blast on Alakazam, and that miss mattered. If I if I there, if I could hit the Focus Blast, I could have killed this thing with double hit. And now he has plus one D, plus one speed, and plus one attack, and plus two attack. He's going to rape my poke, pokes. And as my Alakazam dies at this point, I was like, yeah, I can't. Uh, Alakazam was my only chance to kill last his pokes. 
but yeah, my Torterra is just a freaking monster. He takes the Seed Bomb like a Torterra and he gets the first turn wake, so that was just awesome. Torterra doesn't like to sleep, that was awesome. And I kill this bitch off with a uh, Earthquake and he goes into Ultra version 1 and I go for the Earthquake. Uh, he goes for a Magnet Rise and I was like, what the grandmother fat asshole. That was just wow. He avoided my freaking earthquake. And now he hits me with hidden power fire, he said, for it's just like for Steelixes and shit. And actually I don't know if that crit mattered. Probably not, but anyways. So I go into my polyrath, he goes for a discharge. I I get the parahex and get the first turn parahex. That was just fucking gay. And now he wanted to play nice, cause yeah, that Parahex was just really gay, so he's sorry about it too. So he went for um, rest to get his old health back, and I go for a waterfall, and this uh, Raikou is actually max defense, so that did like nothing to the Raikou, which was very unfortunate, cause I'm max attack and shit, so yeah. And you know that Polyrath is, is kinda beast. And now I'm li trying to kill this thing with a waterfall, but... It doesn't work pretty, I mean, it doesn't work a lot anyways. Um, yeah, the electromagnetism or shit returned to normal, that was just wow. So, yeah, and I already know that at this point, even if I kill this Raikou, I won't be able to kill off his Porygon's Porygon 2, because, uh, yeah, S Ultra version 4 is kinda monster, and, yeah, by the way, thanks guys for 500 subscribers. I have to thank a lot Xenon3120, he gave me just just an awesome shout out, I just, I'm seriously, that shout out was just fucking awesome, thanks a lot. And yeah, I kill off his Raikou with a crit on Shadow Ball, I didn't know if that mattered, yeah, probably not. So yeah, then again, um, he has this Porygon too, and yeah, that's... This guy, this game at this point. So I will actually leave the shadow ball, shadow ball, and the 500 sub special battle is coming up soon. And um, yeah, because I have it already. I already made it when I had like for uh, 30 subscribers, something. Yeah, and good game, Xenon. It turned out to be a pretty nice battle. I hope you all enjoyed this. And if if you didn't already sub Xenon, I think all of you already subbed him because yeah um, if you didn't for some weird reason I will leave a link in the description to his channel check him out subscribe to him subscribe of course to me because uh, 500 subscribers just fucking win I'm re I really appreciate that guys so um, uh, yeah this narration was wasn't actually that great but um, then again I'm very sorry because um, I had like a training in the morning, I'm kinda exhausted in, a, in my swimming pool, then I'm kinda sick, I have my throat hurts a lot, so uh, yeah, I can't talk nice and can't scream like I always do sometimes, but I just, I needed to upload this battle, so uh, thank you all for watching guys, enjoy your day, and don't become a monkey, okay? I'm just saying, I don't wanna have subscribers monkeys, so... Uh, thanks for everything, guys, and great count. Yeah, Xenon, thanks again for the battle, for the shout out. Uh, what else to say? Rate, comment, subscribe, and see you all next time. Bye. Oh, that was actually gay. Yeah, whatever. So, rate, comment, uh, like, comment, subscribe, and see you all next time.